A simple three-step plan to stop sugar cravings, people tend to crave junk food a lot. I personally believe this to be the main reason it can be so hard to stick to a healthy diet. Cravings are driven by the brain's need for reward not the body's need for food. If you can have one bite and stop there, then indulging a little when you get a craving is absolutely fine. But if you tend to binge and overeat as soon as you get a taste of sugary foods, then giving in to the cravings is the worst thing you can do. Here is a simple three-step plan to stop sugar cravings. You can do one of them. If one doesn't work, you can do two, or all three. 1. If at all hungry, eat a meal. It is important to realize that a craving is not the same as hunger. It's not your body calling for energy, it is the brain calling for something that releases a lot of dopamine in the reward system. However, if you get a craving and you're hungry, that just makes it much, much worse. A craving combined with hunger is a powerful drive that most people's willpower will have a hard time overcoming. If you get a craving and you are at all hungry, then start cooking immediately and eat a healthy meal. Eating real food may not feel very appetizing at the moment you have a craving for something like ice cream, but do it anyway. 2. Take a hot shower What I have personally found to be the most effective way to get rid of a real endless craving is to take a hot shower. The water must be hot, not so hot that you burn your skin but hot enough that it is on the verge of feeling uncomfortable. Let the water run over your back and shoulders and let it heat you up. Stay there at least 5 to 10 minutes. By the time you step out of the shower, you are likely to have a dazed feeling, like when you've been sitting in the sauna for a long time. At that point, your craving will most likely be gone. 3. Go for a walk. Distance yourself. Another thing that can work is to go outside for a brisk walk. If you are a runner, then running will be even better. This serves a twofold purpose. First of all, you are distancing yourself from the food that you are craving. Second, the exercise will release endorphins, some feel-good chemicals in your brain, which can help turn the craving off. If you can't go outside, do a few exhausting sets of burpees, push-ups, body weight squats or any other body weight exercise. Also, if you eat healthy and exercise several times per week then chances are you won't get cravings nearly as often. Here are some other methods you may find useful. Have a glass of water. Eat a fruit. Avoid artificial sweeteners. Eat more protein. Talk to a friend. Sleep well. Don't starve yourself. I hope these tips can help you quit sugar. Thank you for watching. Please like and share this video to your friends who need it.